everybody, and welcome to Animal Crossing New Horizons. My name is Theo. And my name is Devin. Today, in Animal Crossing New Horizons, we will be catching all the bugs, fish, and sea creatures new in August. Also, we will be working on a project, but we will be getting to that later. So, before it turns 4 o'clock, we will be catching the walker cicada. Let's get to it! Oh yeah, in between episodes, we had another villager move in. One of our dreamies! All from the RNG and La. Sherb! And we see the walker cicada. Let's try to catch it. Hopefully I don't mess this up. And there we have it. The walker cicada. And the next bug on our list is the Rice Grasshopper. We're having trouble finding the final bug in August, the Migratory Locust. So instead, we're going to take a quick dip in the ocean and try to find the Flatworm, the new creature found in the month of August. Looks like we have spotted the Flatworm in our horizons. Let's try catching it. And there it is, the flatworm. Hooray, we have caught all of the new sea creatures for August and caught a few of the new bugs too. Now we need to use some fish bait to get all of the new fish and we need some little plants. Let's do this in the form of a time lapse. of manila clams for fish bait. Ironically, we found a long and thin shadow in the ocean, and of course, this was a moray eel. Also, our luck got better and we encountered a migratory locust and we caught it. Now we only have two more critters left for the new critters in August. And these include the ray and the softshell turtle. The softshell turtle is located in a cliff top river and the ray is located at the ocean. So let's go and catch the softshell turtle first. a soft shell turtle and also a ray. Now it's time to donate all of our critters that we got today. 
to the museum. Let's donate all of our critters to the museum. Today, we caught a walker cicada, a rice grasshopper, a migratory locust, a flatworm, a softshell turtle, a moray eel, and a ray. All of these are new critters for August. Great, we've donated all the possible things we can, except for a barrel eye, which we will do in between episodes one day. But not today. Our critter preview is filled to the brim with insects, bugs, and sea creatures, and with the migratory locust, rice grasshopper, walker cicada, softshell turtle, ray, moray eel, and flatworm, we have expanded our critter preview to the max for August, with the exception of the bear eye. With the start of August, in Nook shopping, there are new seasonal goods. These include the rodeo style springy ride on. Higaboshi outfit and or a Hime outfit. We'll be taking one of each. Since the summer update wave two drops for August, there are going to be fireworks shows every Sunday night. So we are going to participate in one of them tomorrow, and along with that, we are going to be working on a project. It is now the next day, and today is Sunday, and this means there's a fireworks show tonight. And since it's a fireworks show, Isbel is out here. Let's see what she has to give us. And she has some sort of accessory for us, and it's a heart ball. And it's the same thing for Thea. During the fireworks show, there are a lot of things you can do. One of these includes Red's Raffle, and Red's Raffle will make you draw a ticket, and each ticket corresponds with a certain prize. And so we're going to be purchasing many different tickets, and these tickets will help us get a lot of items. We'll be trying to get as many items as possible by participating in Red's Raffle and drawing tickets. So, let's do this in the form of a time lapse.
place to watch the fireworks is the secret beach. So, if we go back behind the shopping district and go behind the cliff tops, we'll get to our secret garden. And at our secret garden is where our secret beach is located at. And this is where we are going to be watching the fireworks. So let's sit back, relax, and enjoy the show. Design and maybe even our dog Ralphie. Let's see if we can see it. In the sky. And there it is, the Aquarius flag. That looks beautiful. And even the Aquarius urn and our dog Ralphie. Oh, this is just so beautiful. The project we'll be working on today is the festivity stall in the shopping district. This is a small project, but it's a good project because Red's Raffle includes a lot of festive items, including balloons, pinwheels, tweeters, sparklers, and more. And we're going to be displaying this in our festivity stall. To decorate our festivity stall, we're going to be placing balloons on the right and left. For the right, we're going to be placing a green balloon. And to the left, we're going to be placing a pink balloon. Perfect. On the right here, we're going to be placing a piano bench. And this piano bench is going to be acting as a stool for the tweeter. And also, on the left here, we're going to be placing a rotten end table. And this table will have a pinwheel on top of it. Great! With a few minor changes, this stall looks amazing. With new items from Red's Raffle, this improves the look of the festivity stall greatly. Now, that's all for today's video. If you enjoyed, make sure to leave a like. And if you really enjoyed, Make sure to subscribe. Don't forget to hit that notification bell. Good.
Goodbye.